Hi everyone, it's been so so long since I filmed, well it feels like it's been so long since I filmed my last video and girl I really need to step it up. It's just so hard as I'm here in college and like I don't have a place to film really because my roommate's always here and then I don't want to intrude and like it's just hard for me to just sit down and take a camera out and start filming but you know I always gotta make it work. So I'm going to start off with moisturizing. I miss filming so so much actually because like filming is when I can like have my personality come through and talk to you guys. Please ignore my skin like I have breakouts everywhere everyone just freaking hates me life hates me my skin hates me but makeup doesn't so that's why I'm doing it eh. Now I'm priming with the Milani prime light this is new I just got it. What I was saying was um everyone comes from a different background and raised differently and you know, I totally understand, but um, it just sucks because um, people are still very closed-minded, I, I want to say, or they're not exposed to people like me, I guess, and it's unfortunate because it's their loss, the fuck. I realized that um, I'm not always going to be accepted, and that's okay because I understand and I respect people's opinions and their views, but it just sucks because... Bullying, you know, like bullying never fucking ends. You just gotta have a thick skin and just give them two fingers. And you know the fingers, which fingers I'm talking about, okay? Now I'm gonna use the Fit Me 320 Natural Tan. Also, I changed my shirt because the freaking green brown shirt was not okay. I looked like the swamp. But what I wanna tell y'all from learning from my experiences. Um, with bullying and um, being put down and rejected and whatnot, even from people you know. So, um, you just have to have a thick skin. If you're bullied, if you're put down, take it and allow it to make you stronger because you can rise from the occasion and you will come through, okay? Don't let anything triumph your happiness because no one's opinions matter but your own and then people's opinions will like will affect you sometimes but you have to know that you can only be sad for so long you can't just let that phase you girl like you, you gotta keep moving you gotta pack your bags you gotta keep going like you don't fucking stay in a slump like no you gotta like show them who's boss who's a slain bitch um not them the fuck um what is my hair? Like, who knows? Now I'm going to conceal with my Maybelline Fit Me. Now I'm going to set the under eye with my Ratchet powder. Now I'm going to be doing my eyebrows with the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade. I'm just gonna outline my brows with this NYX Cosmetics Micro Brow Pencil. So after that, I'm gonna be wiping the bake off my face. Now I'm going to bronze up my face using this NYC Cosmetics thing that I always use. Now I'm just going to um, put some blush on from this e.l.f. palette my friend gave me. I think I'm just going to go for a very like pinky orange look for the s what time is this time of year is this spring summer who knows. I'm going to use the 35O palette. How gorgeous is this? Taking this color right here, I'm going to be putting that into my crease. Who knows what I'm doing, honestly. I think I'm going for a clown look. From the 35 B palette, I'm just going to use this red right here to deepen up what I already have. Using a more 
taupey color or brownish color. I don't know. I'm just gonna use that and go under what I put down. Now I'm using like a more brown color to deepen up it even more. I'm just keeping it out on the outer half and slightly bringing it, bringing it in. I'm going to do, um, cut the, do a half cut crease, so I'm going to use concealer and cut half. I'm just going to go over what I put down with gold eyeshadow from the Morphe 35O palette. And bringing some of the red that I have up here, I'm bringing it down. And some of the brown here, I'm bringing it down to the V as well. Okay, so now I think I'm just going to be throwing on some lashes if I feel like it. And then mascara or whatever. And liner if I can do it. Um, and I'll be right back. Okay, so now I'm just trying to let the eyelash glue dry. I know it looks a hot raggedy old mess right now. I'm just gonna highlight as I wait with the Ulta Beauty strobing palette. I'm gonna be using the creamy side first. After putting the creamy highlight down first, now I'm gonna be taking the Wet n Wild um, highlighting powder to put down the areas where I put the creamy highlight down. Why do I have the sponge? rude guys, um, this is basically the finished look thank you guys so much for watching and for all the support you guys don't understand how much it means to me um honestly i wouldn't be doing it without you guys i definitely will keep on practicing and try to put more con um create more content for you guys all and but if not stay tuned and keep um keep up with keep updated with my instagram txc makeup that's where i post almost all my makeup looks and that's basically it until next time thanks for watching bye guys Ain't gonna sleep tonight